What's up, my YouTube brothers and sisters? This is Rockwell43 coming at you with um, some new uh, channel stickers from some good brothers. Um, I'm not going to do a roll call. I'm just going to show the new stickers this time. Uh, got a couple other things I want to show you. Um, so, real quick, we got uh, Mr. Sabat X, Mr. RC Persuader. And I think this is the coolest sticker of all. No disrespect to none of you other guys because you guys got some nice stickers. But this is an awesome idea. And it's real scaled. And man, it's nice. It's got a little weight to it too. <laughs> but uh, I'm pretty sure everybody knows where this came from. Uh, Mr. James Johnson RC. Really appreciate that, brother. I mean, that's a real good idea. It's awesome, original. So uh, thanks a lot, my friend. Um, this is a new channel board. My old board got jacked up. Um, the material is nasty. I left it in the garage, and um, a lot of you guys, I did have extra stickers, so I put you guys on there. Um, a few of you, I'm gonna read off that I don't have. Um, we got RC Persuader on the board, Mr. RC Persuader and Mr. Uh, Sabat X. Um, as well and then see the midwid that's always cool and some encouragement <laughs> awesome awesome Mr. Blacksmith RC so um, I'm gonna put you in the tripod and I'm gonna read off the guys that if you can possibly send me some new stickers I would really appreciate it for the board uh, I'm putting you in the tripod real quick uh, Sorry about that. Sorry all the movement. Let me try to get this right. There we go. Um, the new stickers that that I would. Well, I hope you guys can help me out with these new stickers. Uh, for my well, the stickers for my new board. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, that's Mister uh, Thunder nineteen three hundred one. Uh, Mister RC Car Rookie. Mister Wig Splitters. Mister Tin Man. Mister Wayne Peoples. Uh, Mr. RC FPV Vids, Mr. Dan P, Mr. Hyde Behard 82, and Mr. Too Quick for You 104, um, Mr. Big James RC. Uh, I hope I ain't missing anybody. Uh, Mr. RC Kiddo. Uh, I did have extra stickers from you, brothers, but they're in white well some of you guys um but they're in white and it's not going to show up on the board so um if you guys can please help me out with some uh new ones um and if anybody else uh wants to swap or just wants my stickers um it's not a problem i'll get them out to you just let me know uh, i want to read these notes from these good brothers uh first one's from Mr. Sabat X uh, says, Rockbud43, hey brother, thanks for the decals. Here are my decals. Hope you like them. Keep pulling them triggers, Mr. Sabat X. Uh, thanks a lot, my friend. And um, happy birthday to your son. And got some awesome <laughs> projects going on over there. I've seen the uh, slash two wheel drive that you got the chassis and upper brace from a uh, high gear RC that's that's awesome man and you know it seems like you got the same problem I got <laughs> a bunch of projects going on and uh, not enough time to finish them but um that's our addiction man and you know welcome to the brotherhood again um, the next brother is mr. RC persuader it says mr. Rockbud. here's a few of my channel stickers Thank you for your support and great videos. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, praying for you and yours. Peace. Mr. RC Persuader. Um, yo, thanks for the prayers, man. And that, that goes to everybody that, uh, you know, had the encouraging words through my, you know, tough times. Um, like I said, it's all, it's, uh, you guys helped me a lot. Um, I really appreciate that. And uh, 
you know, keep on doing your thing too, my man. Um, that two-wheel drive slash you're, you're running. Um, and his next brother is Mr. James Johnson, RC. Uh, says, Rockbud43, here's the Nas bottle, as promised. Hope you enjoy it. Your brother, James Johnson, RC. Oh, yes. Definitely enjoy it, man. And like I said, original. And that that's just <laughs> that's nice. Um, real detailed. Looks just like the real thing. That is awesome. So um, you know, like I said, thanks thank thanks to all you guys, man, and you know, keep doing your thing. There's some brothers out there doing some awesome stuff. And you know, my last video I said about the Mr. thing. Um I don't want nobody to get the wrong idea. I'm not saying that everybody has to say Mr. I'm saying for me, that's what I chose to do to let you guys know that I had that you know my level of respect. So, you know, that that's what that's about. Um, and I, I, I do think that a lot of you guys that I deal with, you know, have respect for me. So, you know, that's what that's all about. So real quick, I'm going to show you what's going on. I don't want to, you know, take a lot, a lot of time. So I'm going to get these bodies out of the way. Um, Right here on the table, uh, this is Bruckner Hobbies. I always uh, wait for some kind of sale from them, and I just go nuts with the wheels. Uh, you don't find them anywhere cheaper. These are for my uh, my Serpent 977. I'm gonna be trying out them wheels on there. That that builds a go. I'm gonna end up building it, and I got some more uh, temp scale wheels as well. These big humongous things here uh, VGAD hip me to these VGAD 23 let me know these was out these are one well on the pack let me see what it says on the packaging these are actually one fourth scale wheels so they're, they're even bigger than the fifth scale but uh, we got project going on He's a little far going than mine, a little farther than I am. Now, if you see the size difference, that's an on-road tire by Sweeps. Uh, you see the size difference is huge. Um, looked at a couple forums. Uh, pe the people that have tried them out likes them. Uh, and like I said, he has a project going on. Um, I don't want, I'm not showing you guys the rush to jump on these because I really don't know how they perform. And when, when he, you know, does his thing with his and lets me know, and eventually I get to do my thing, then, you know, um, I'll, I'll definitely let you know what, what we think. Uh, the thing about these are, is that you don't need to get an adapter. Um, like the GRPs, you gotta get an adapter. Uh, these are 17 millimeter hex um, so that's gonna make it good uh, you know some of the forums said that they don't balloon it that bad so you know just another option gonna try out see see what happens and like I said uh, once I get information from him or you know get my own runs in uh, definitely let you know what's going on with that and I'm making something because, you know, I had them belted tires from VGAD uh, with the Teflon um, that I wanted to try out. But I, I want, I'm, I'm making something that I can just go and test tires. I'm going to make an RC just for testing tires. You know, I got some parts. I'm going to make a Frankenstein something <laughs> just so I can test some tires. Um, also, you guys know I'm a Delta Plastic. I like their uh, bodies. Um... This body here, I had to do a lot of stuff to get it to fit on the RC um, because, let me turn this around. Let me see if you can see that. Yep, let me zoom in a little bit. <laughs> Sorry about that. But if you see this upper deck, that's where I used to put my stuff. But I had to 
get it to fit down in there so that this doesn't sit on there because it sits extremely flat and I'm hoping that the aerodynamics will help and uh, I'm probably going to cut stuff out but I'm going to just it's, I'm going to test with it first you know what I mean test it see what it does uh, see what reactions I get and cut and trim as I'm going uh, and then I'll also let you guys know about that but I had to make a little well first I had to customize these for the body so that it would fit these are actually uh Entergy um, body mount holders and I tapped them and everything the reason why one's gray and one's blue is because I messed the other blue one up trying to tap it but uh got these two to work so and then I also made a tray for my uh, GPS so I'm gonna be trying that out and I got you know the new contact wheels so I'm gonna put some black ones on there different uh, sure and see if I can get a better outcome where, where I'm running right now because um, we're still looking for that elusive street uh, like I said that's a test body once I figure out what I can do with it I'll be able to I have another one this is a Lola they're both Lola attempt scale bodies got the small cockpit but like I said everything else sits flat so your upper deck is you might as well not <laughs> you're not going to put nothing on the upper deck with this so like I said, it's just, you know, something I'm trying out to add to the testing and tuning. So um, video's running long. Sorry about that. Uh, so I'm going to get out of here. Until the next video, peace.